a dim red speck blooms on screen, then swells like a heartbeat. I'm zooming to Zeboidjira year 8.6, just 570 million years after the Big Bang. Meet Canucks LRD Z8.6, one of the little red dots. Red dots whisper the cosmos's hidden origin, monsters from the dawn. Here's the twist. This tiny galaxy hides a black hole around a hundred million suns, not a billion-year heavyweight, an infant, already massive and growing fast. That's not supposed to happen. JWST's Nyar spec caught the faintest light and split it apart. In the spectrum, highly ionized gas whipping around a central engine, classic signs of a hungry, accreting black hole. Compared to the AGN candidate GNZ11 at Zetters 10.6, this black hole is roughly a hundred times more massive. How does that even fit inside a galaxy this compact? Picture a core only about 70 parsecs across, stuffed with roughly 5 billion solar masses of stars, like a city of suns, and in the middle, a black hole that's devouring fuel. The galaxy's metal content? maybe 10 to 20 percent of the suns that's shockingly primitive for something so dense hinting at fresh pristine gas pouring in little red dots don't play by the rules they're challenging our models of how galaxies and black holes grow together what if in the early universe black holes sprinted while their galaxies stumbled behind universe breaking maybe some ideas giant seed black holes born from collapsing primordial clouds or runaway feeding frenzies on cold streams of gas. Either way, these dots feel less like cute embryos and more like black hole nurseries under red lights. Webb raised more questions than answers, and I love that. The team is lining up more JWST time and calling in Alma from the Atacama Desert to hunt the cold gas and dust. If Canucks LRD Z8.6 is an evolutionary link, it could bridge quiet seedlings to the blazing quasars that lit up the cosmos a billion years later. So tell me, are LRDs the missing chapter? Fast-growing black hole babies everywhere in the early universe? Or are we seeing something entirely new? Drop your theory in the comments. Hit like for the dots. I'll bring more spectra, more sims, and more mysteries from the red-shifted void. Because sometimes, the smallest specks hide the biggest monsters.